Hello everyone, welcome to back my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Fans of the show bringing up Bates have discovered some odd tidbits on Chad and Aaron Payne's blog. What is happening with the pair is being questioned by certain people. Read on to find out what fans have learned. While some fans do seem to enjoy the couple's blog posts, something doesn't quite add up. What do Chad and Aaron Payne publish online? If you weren't aware, Chad and Aaron have a blog that has been around for a while. Some of their posts date back at least 12 years. The couple frequently posts devotionals, inspirational messages, and other works of a similar nature on their blog. They advertise their most recent YouTube videos there and share updates about their families. There are a number of methods for fans to stay in touch with them even after bringing up Bates ends. Fans of bringing up Bates observe strange behavior. A Bates fan reported an odd occurrence on Chad and Aaron's blog recently on Reddit. A screenshot of the Bates couple's most recent blog entry was provided by the Reddit member. Zira Castellino is the author of the blog entry titled, What the Word of God Does for Us. Be encouraged, it advises at the blog post conclusion. Aaron. Therefore, even though it appears that Aaron wrote the letter, Zira actually posted it to the site. Actually, Aaron's perspective is used throughout the entire blog piece, which even mentions her most recent YouTube video. Based on their YouTube videos, followers of Bringing Up Bates believe that Aaron and Chad hire a friend to write their blogs for them. But by leaving his name in the post and adding Aaron's at the conclusion, it appears like he committed a few errors. The Reddit member who first wrote about it provided this explanation. The Duke cannot be bothered to proofread and remove his name. This is the third time. I noticed it two days ago and decided to give them a minute. The fan then urged Chad and Aaron to get it together and sort out this ongoing issue with their blog. Based on the blog post, another fan speculated that there is a lot more going on behind the scenes. They wrote, they are struggling financially and maybe even with their faith. It's okay to admit things are bad. What do you think? Have your say in the comments below. Be sure to catch up on everything happening with the Duggars right now. Come back here often for more counting on news and updates.